When a new document is created in Microsoft Word, it creates multiple pages in one section throughout the document. Breaks may be used to create new sections by inserting a page break, a section break, or a column break into your document. In this example, we will insert a page break to reposition a chart on a new page. Then we'll change the layout of the page to landscape while all other pages remain in normal layout. Landscape orientation is the view or layout of a page that has a wider view than the default page orientation. This layout can be used in a research paper when an item such as a table or a graph is too large or wide for the normal page layout. Here we have a graph that needs to be moved onto a new page because the graph has been created on the references page. The first step is to position the cursor below the graph just before the word references. Navigate to the page layout tab and locate the page setup group. Click the breaks button to open a menu and choose page. As you can see, the page break has moved the references onto a new page without pressing the enter key on your keyboard. And the graph is now on the page alone without any text. The next step is to change the page layout to landscape orientation to accommodate the size of the graph. To do this, you'll need to section off the graph by inserting a section break before the graph and after the graph in the document. Position your cursor on the last line of the previous page and then click the page layout tab. In the page setup group, click the breaks button. Select next page on the menu. This will insert a break and start a new section on the page. Now position the cursor on the bottom of the page with the graph and insert another section break. Click the breaks button on the page layout tab. Select next page. Creating a new section will allow you to change the layout of one page without changing the layout of any other pages. If any additional space or extra pages are created after inserting a section break or a page break, press the delete key on your keyboard to eliminate the extra space or extra pages. The next thing you'll need to do is change the orientation. Click the page layout tab and click the orientation button. Choose landscape. As you can see, the page with the graph is changed to landscape and all other pages remain in normal layout. Again, if any extra space or additional pages are created, press the delete key on your keyboard until the extra space is eliminated. By following these steps, you can create page breaks and section breaks within your paper.